Hello children, let us continue with exercise 1.3. We will do now example number 3. Express the following in P upon Q form. So you are given some decimals, okay. You have to write them in P upon Q form where P and Q are integers and Q not equal to 0. The first number given to you is 0 0.6 bar. Okay, now what does this bar means? Bar represents the repeating unit. That means 6 is repeated infinite times. So first take the given number equal to x. So x equal to 0 0.6 bar. So x is equal to 0 0.6 will repeat infinitely. 6, 6, 6, 6. Okay, dot, dot, dot. Now see how many numbers are repeating. Only one number is repeating. That is 6. So if one number is repeating, we will multiply 10 on both the side. If two numbers are repeating, we will multiply 100 on both the sides. So here only if three numbers are repeating, you will multiply 1000. Here only one number that is 6 is repeating. So you will multiply 10 on both the side. 10 into x is equal to 10 into 0 0.666 dot dot dot. 10 into x equal to 10x. Now when we multiply 0 0.666 by 10, it will move, uh, decimal will move one unit towards right. So you will get 6.666, so 6.6666 dot dot dot. Below this, you have to write the x term. x equals to 0 0.6666. Now subtract these two terms. Okay, 10x minus x, that is equal to 9x. Now 6 minus 6, 6 minus 0, 6 point 6 minus 6, 0, all this will become 0, okay. Now, we are getting 6.0, that means 6. Take 9 in the denominator, so 6 upon 9, 3 twos are 6, 3 threes are 9. So, answer is 2 upon 3. Same way, 0 0.47 bar, okay. Bar is there only on 7, so 7 will repeat, 4 will not repeat. So, how can we write x, take this as x, so x equal to 0 0.4. Bar is there on 7, so 7 will repeat infinite times. So 7, 7, 7, 7, continue. Now, as only one number, that is 7, is repeating, multiply. One number is repeating, multiply 10 on both the sides. So 10 into x is equal to 10 into 0 0.4777. 10 into x, 10x. One decimal will go right. So 4.7777 dot dot dot. Below this, we will write x value of x that is 0 0.4777 now subtract this 10x minus x so 9x point 4 minus 0 so 4 7 minus 4 so 3 7 minus 7 0 all these will become 0 remove the zeros so what you will get to x is equal to 4.3 upon 9 here if we remove decimal after decimal one digit is there so we will put one zero so you are get you will get 43 upon 90 same way you can do the sum number 3 in homework. Okay, example number 4. Express 0 0.9999 dot 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 in the form of P upon Q. Same way you have done this, you can do this also. This sum also is above. Are you surprised by your answer with your um, teacher and classmate discuss why the answer makes a sense? So does this answer make a sense? First find out the answer. The given number is 0 0.9999. So take it as x. Okay, only one number that is 9 is repeating. So multiply 10 on both the side. 10 into x, 10x. When uh, 10, uh, 10 is multiplied with 0 0.9999, one decimal will go right. So you will get 9.9999. You can repeat 9 infinite times. Below this I will write x and below this I will write 0 0.999. Subtract this. 10x minus x. So 9x. 9 minus 0, that is 9, 9, 9 minus 9, 0, rest all will become 0. Okay, so you, what will, re, uh, after decimal, 0 is no value. So take 9 in denominator, so x equal to 9 upon 9, that is equal to 1. Okay, so here the answer of x is 1. Now, does the answer make sense? The answer makes sense. Why? Because see, the question, the number is given to you is 0 0.9999 which is very near to 1. These two are almost the same. So you can say 0 0.9999 is equal to 1. So that means this answer is correct. Okay. So it, <coughs> next example. 
what can be the maximum number of digits be in the repeating block of uh, di block of the digits in decimal expansion of 1 upon 17 what does what does this mean actually we don't have to divide and we if we divide 1 by 17 you will get some number okay uh, that will be recurring number non terminating recurring now in the recurring number how many numbers are there in the repeating unit means how many numbers will be there under the bar okay so you can check after that you have to check it by division also okay so the number given to you is 1 upon 17 the so maximum number of digits in the repeating unit how many maximum digits can be there in the repeating unit that is under the bar how many digits can be there so can be in the repeating block of the digits in decimal expansion of 1 upon 17 so here in denominator 17 is there so 1 less than 17 is 16 so maximum 16 numbers can be there under the bar okay not more than that if the denominator is 17 1 less than 17 is 16 so maximum how many numbers can there can be there in the repeating block so 16 uh, digits can be there you can check it by dividing if i divide 1 by 17 i get 0 0.05 double eight two three five two nine four one one seven six four seven you can divide it and check it now see how many repeating numbers are there um, under the bar one two three four one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen so sixteen numbers are there one less than seventeen so maximum number of digits in the repeating block of one one upon seventeen is 16 example 6 you can try it on your own now let us move to example number 17 write three numbers whose decimal expansion are non-terminating non-recurring so you have to write three non-terminating non-recurring decimals so how to write okay first of all in non-terminating non-recurring so the, the number after decimals will be infinite second thing the order will not be the same so i can select any number suppose i have taken 0 0.30 the once i will again i will write 3 then 0 will be repeated twice 3 0 will be repeated thrice 3 4 times 0 3 5 times 0 this will continue here number 3 and 0 are repeated but they are not repeated in the same order so it is non-terminating non-recurring same way i took 5.0 and 1 then double zero one, triple zero one. triple zero one. 4 times 0 1 so this is also not pi value of pi 3.1416 here see the same number is not repeating it will continue different numbers will come in the decimal place so this is also non-terminating non-recurring 